Sarah. It's your turn. <laughs> Sorry, right. time. We're back for smoothie part two, Sarah's way. So what I do with mine is I really like a thin smoothie. I'm not a big fan of a thick smoothie. And today I'm working with a little bit of a thicker protein powder. So for me, hot water, 100%. I always start with the hot water. Um, How much do you use, Sarah? I, I use that much and I don't pay attention. <laughs> <laughs> See, I, I must know because I must have the exact measurement. Sarah eyeballs it. Yeah, so I totally eyeball it. If we're looking, this is like a cup. It actually worked out to a cup. Wow. So you just eyeball a cup. Okay, so from there, I'm also going to add the almond milk that I use. Um, again, I eyeball it. It really depends for me whether I'm making two smoothies, if I'm double batching a smoothie or if I'm just making a single breakfast smoothie. For today, I'm just making a single breakfast smoothie and this looks like it's coming up to like one and a half, which is not going to be enough for the powder that I'm using. So I'm going to go up to two, so a cup of this as well. So today I have the pumpkin protein powder and this is what we recommend for like vegan protein powder. It's really great in the second half of your cycle. If you've ever done seed cycling, this is like the one to have. Um, it is thicker and it has a, a, like a pumpkin taste, but it's, no, it doesn't have pumpkin taste. I totally lied. <laughs> <laughs> it has like a... A pumpkin seed butter taste. Yeah, it's like a, I don't even know how to Seeds. describe it. It's like just, a... it's a really, it's really grainy, I find. So with this, this is how I do it. Mm, I don't know. I probably do like two heaping. This is a teaspoon. This is one and a half tablespoons. Let's go with three. That looks right, right? And why do you want to go with three, Sarah? Because I might need the extra protein in my day to get through to get through what I need to do. Um, I'm always going for the higher protein content than anything else. Then today I'm going to put peanut butter in. And again, really random. I use the same spoon. If you noticed in the last video, Terry uses actual measuring spoons. <laughs> so I'm going to pop that in. I'm going to use a tablespoon or a teaspoon. Mm, and then flax for sure. I'm going to do two tablespoons. I think that's what this is. Yeah. Two tablespoons and collagen, any kind of collagen. This is what we have on hand because yes, I just turned 40 and I'm vain. Uh, <laughs> I'm also going to add a half of a green banana. <clears throat> sometimes I have the green banana protein or the green banana powder. Sometimes I don't. So it'll totally depend whether I'm putting it in. Putting in just a little less than a half. I'm going to go with some chocolate because hot chocolate smoothie is kind of a dream. I think I'm doing a table, tablespoon of that. Oops, wrong lid. So many lids. All right, I'm gonna blend that up. I have everything in there. It's kind of coming out to like a, I think it's coming out to like a three cup ratio here now that I have everything in the blender. and just leave it blending because I really don't like having the gritty um, flat seed and the gritty pumpkin seed. I just, it's not my favorite thing in the whole world. So for all intents and purposes, this has been blended for at least a minute, maybe two. And look at that, a nice hot chocolate smoothie. Perfect for my hormones. <laughs> 